In this section, we're going to quickly learn how to publish the documents to PDF. Here are my sample files, the Excel file, the PowerPoint, and the Word document. First, I'm going to go to my Visual Basic for Excel, insert a new module. Let's call this Publish to PDF. Dim output file as string. This output file is going to hold the path and the name of the file. So, this workbook dot name, this will return us the name of the workbook. But from there, we just want to take the name of the file. So, I'm going to do left this workbook dot name. And from there, I'm going to take the land and subtract minus 5. This will just give us the name of the file without the extension. And here I'll just add .pdf. Okay, that looks good. Uh, along with the name of the file, we want to include the name the, the workbook part as well. Okay, that looks good. This will be the name of our final file. I'm gonna copy that. output file name is equal to this workbook part and this workbook.name and changing that xlsm to pdf okay now we'll write a source state one more statement to publish this hit one is what i want to publish so we'll say export as fixed format the format will be pdf the file name here is going to be the output file and the quality can be um, Excel quality standard. You can, you know, include all these properties. Um, some of the application will have a wide variety, so uh, it should be okay even if you do not include them. Here, some of them are ignore print areas. Uh, you can specify if you want to export from certain page, from page seven to eight, for an example or if you want to open them after it's been published. So I'm, I'll just leave it as it is for now. I'm gonna run this code. Once it completes, we'll expect the file to be exported into this folder. Publishing it now. Seems to be working okay. And here is my PDF file. Quickly opening it. It's published 38 pages very smoothly. Okay, now we're gonna quickly replicate this for um, Word document and PowerPoint first. I'm gonna to go to my PowerPoint. Again, insert a module. The name is gonna be same. Instead of this workbook, let's do um, active presentation. And here, instead of sheet one, we want to export. If I debug this now, for example. So it's giving us VBA underscore PDF dot pdf so it seems to be working okay now we'll publish this powerpoint to pdf active presentation dot export as fixed format it will take in the first as the file part let's copy the output file part paste it here this will be again pdf and then you can um, intend for print and it is wide again it's wide varieties of properties I'll just leave it as it is for now to default so once I run this code it's gonna publish again to to the destination folder here publishing it and here is a file that got published okay so finally we'll gonna we'll, go, we'll do this for um, Word document, so Visual Basic. Uh, from this document, I'm going to insert a module. We'll call it uh, instead of this workbook, we can say this will be active document. I'll replace this workbook with active document. And here, instead of sheet one, we'll have to use active document again. It's pretty much the same thing, but just to give you a better idea. This will be the file part. And then we can say export it format as PDF. And um, do you want to open 
after it is published I'll just say yes for this one just try it out so once this is published it will open up a PDF file itself so yep seems to be all working fine 